All right, man, we start off with 100 of these, four sets of 25. 100 of these, four sets of 25. And 100 of these, four sets of 25. Getting ready for a speed squat and speed deadlift day. Very, very satisfied with depth on the uh, on the speed squats. Now, there's a little tipping forward there, but, you know, I mean, no squats perfect, right? So, we're looking at depth. I lowered the safety belts down another notch, so they're at they're at notch 20. When I first started training, um, I had them at notch 22. So now I have them at notch 20, and the depth getting to the depth was easier. My knees are recovering. I'm a little bit faster. Not where I want to be by any means, but um, it was a much shorter workout today. Much shorter training session, that means my legs are, are recovering well, my knees are coming back. My squat form is getting dialed in, that's a very, very good feeling. Um, I'm working with my new custom orthotics in my squat shoes today. See, I got that little tipping forward, but that's just a mobility and an upper back strength, upper back tightness issues. So. Uh, maybe if you have a keen eye, you can notice like I was noticing that some reps I tip forward like that one. That's when I let my neck loose from the barbell. Other reps I do not tip forward. That's because um, I felt my upper back tightness really, really like that one. I felt my upper back tightness really, really well on that. So um, getting in super tight into the barbell is getting a lot easier. That means I've got shoulder mobility um, issues that are being solved. I'm really enjoying the, uh, the conjugate training here, the power building phase, before I go, go into a meat prep, whenever that's going to be. And, uh, and I'm really enjoying not having the depth, not having to squat to, uh, um, to anything but just legal depth which is making my knees feel really really good so uh, all in all i'm extremely happy with with uh with the new coach with the way things are or the way things are working out and um yeah no no complaints at all just not a single one the only thing i would like to really improve on is my speed deadlifts today it was 60 percent of my one rep max so this is 335 but um, you know, it's 60% of your one rep max. So it's for four sets of one. I only filmed the last two because the first two I forgot to film. Yeah, I forgot to record actually. No one uses film anymore. That's too bad, but I forgot to record. So I, you guys get the last two. Did not move as fast as I wanted, but again, it's 60% of the one rep max. So the idea is just to be as explosive as powerful and man, you're thinking you're going to be, but then when you start pulling that thing in the sumo, and I never sumo, it's like, Duh! well, at least the lockout was okay. All right, we're going to get to some pull-throughs here, a couple sets of 10, a couple sets of, uh, of uh, to failure. I got uh, 30 reps out of each one of these uh, sort of dragon flags. But all in all, guys, uh, get another day off tomorrow. Get another day to recover. Another day to, to eat uh, moderately because I'm figuring out I don't need that much food. My weight's dropping. I broke my plateau. Body is healing. Everything's feeling good. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.